I think uh, our expectation should be modest, so success would be probably a summit that doesn't end uh, in acrimony and that leads to further negotiations uh, towards some sort of disarmament deal. The ultimate objective we seek from diplomacy with North Korea has not changed. The complete, verifiable, and irreversible denuclearization of the Korea Peninsula is the only outcome that the United States will accept. I don't think we'll achieve irreversible denuclearization ever uh, with the North Koreans, at least not under this North Korean government, uh, certainly not in this meeting. I, I think the North Koreans have strong reasons that they want to keep their nuclear weapons uh, and are not willing to trade that, probably period, or if they are, it's for stuff that is beyond what we're willing to offer and give them. So uh, I don't think that's going to happen. I think the, the best we can do in this meeting is probably make interim steps, some sort of working uh, outline, if you will, towards uh, an agreement that achieves substantially less than that in terms of limiting the range maybe of their missiles and uh, reducing U.S. force posture in South Korea or something along those lines. The ratio of pomp and circumstance to achievement towards uh, an arms control agreement seems to be high. In other words, there's a lot of talk and not a lot of uh, achievement seems to be the likely outcome. So it's historic in that regard and also because we have a president who said he's not going to prepare for it, who is notoriously unpredictable at major meetings and uh, it's a bit of an open question what kind of dramatic uh, things might happen in the negative sense.